had, that was the only time you've been knocked out, you know, and that this might be something where, um, you know, your toughness maybe works again, you know, maybe, maybe instead of getting concussed a couple of times, you go to sleep, it would have been a little easier on you. Cause there were a couple of times where you had that con concussions in fights and then, you know, it doesn't sound like at doom when you guys treated it like, you know, with kid gloves there. So talk, talk about like the after effects and, and like how, how you adjusted in, 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 you know, in the latter part of your career to the headshots. Talk about how many concussions you think you've had. So, well, you talk about the Musail fight. I was probably down two rounds to nothing in that fight, and I actually got dropped twice. And to me, typically, if you get dropped in your leg, you have no legs under you, you know, where you concussion. can't even stand, you probably got a concussion. <laughs> um, oh, but, you, you don't know, know that. <laughs> I know you're, you're right. Who, me? Yeah, who, but, me? You know, <laughs> those were relatively mild concussions. I mean, I've had, if I had to estimate, I would say I've probably had maybe 150 concussions for sure over 100 in my life. Um, and, wow. Christ. And, and I'm almost positive they're concussions. You know, I mean, I've had times in the gym, quite a few times. I mean, guys, mm -hmm. if you interview some of the Doolin guys from that time who sparred with me, I mean, I've had a fair amount of sparring matches. And we, we sparked pretty hard at Doomlin where I'd actually stop the other guy. You know, I'd land a body shot or something and we'd have to stop sparring. But a minute or two before that, I got caught with something. And that's probably why I turned up the intensity and, and ended up stopping the other guy. But I'm trying to remember my mom's maiden name, my birthday, you know, I mean, serious memory loss. And it would last for several hours. So, wow. Un undoubtedly those are concussions you know what i mean for sure you, you know what's nuts you know what's nuts keith i would have to say and i've fought an awful lot i think i probably had one concussion i can ever think of yeah and i don't know why that is isn't that weird i mean even as a kid i i got a few concussions like football soccer even you know middle school age you know i was always any type of headshots i would have issues with memory loss and dizziness so wow and they weren't to the point where like like miguel said i I wasn't prone to getting knocked unconscious and I could usually kind of, you know, find enough equilibrium to get my legs back under me and fight through it. But yeah, I don't think that was, obviously that's not good for your health. You know, I'm, I'm not, I'm not positive. I have bad effects from it, but for sure it's not something I would recommend to people, you know? Okay. So, so from there you go on to fight Carl 